A furry roll is one of the simplest soup I love to cook. I know some people will say it's very, very hard, but it's very, very simple for me. And in this video, I'll be showing the fastest way to make a furry roll without too much drama. So in my pot, I'm pouring some palm oil. I'll be adding some onions and I'll also be adding some low cost beans. See, a furry roll is not complete without low cost beans, even if you're not going to be using so many seasoning. But please make sure you use um, low cost beans. So I've blended my pepper and see, anytime I want to make a furry roll, I make sure I blend the pepper, pepper roughly bit blend it and I will drain all the water to reduce the amount of time which I'm going to use to cook this Efori roll. Um, you're welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for coming through to watch this video. You see this adobo um, seasoning all purple is my all go to seasoning these days it's very very good especially if you have high blood pressure it will help to reduce your blood pressure and i've added some other seasoning inside and uh, to all my returning subscriber thank you so much so i needed to cover it for it to cook to to fry so i'm going to taste it and check for salt and i realized that using too much so i've added just very little so you can see that the salt i use is very very small uh, and what i'm using is this just this um lamb which I've chopped and I've air fried and some turkey which I've also chopped and I've air fried it basically that's what I'm going to be using and I will order I will be adding another thing which uh, the, in the course of this video please watch to the end for you to know what I'll be adding so I'll cover it and look at what it looks like because I'm frying it you see the oil will come back on top I really really like my efori roll to be dry not dry in the sense that you know it won't be moist but it won't be too dry and it won't be too watery so i've added some grilled mackerel fish inside and i'm just going to turn it and i'll still cover it for it to further um for to further dry anyway I didn't cover it so i've added them um, my spinach so my spinach you all know that i always blanch my spinach i will blanch i will cut it and i'll put it in hot water for it to reduce the amount of water inside so right about now when every time i'm cooking it for i make sure that once i put my uh, vegetable my efori roll is done because i like my efori roll to be green you can see how green it is i hope you enjoyed this video please write a comment for me and if you want to see more of my videos please make sure you subscribe to the channel and put your bell on to notify you anytime i drop a new video let me see your comment down there let me know how you make your own a furry roll in your homes do you like my own method let me know if you love it in the comment section till i come your way again with another video um take care stay safe and god bless you and you can use this effort to take to eat any food of your choice bye